Podcast episode 27. We here, man. Through it all, through the coronavirus and all, like we here, man. I'm your host, B.I. Got again, Sass, Sass two four in the man, building. Two four in the building. Queasy's way in the building. And I ran into a special guest yeah. downstairs at the store. You feel me? Uh-huh. He been was supposed to get up here. This is my boy, uh-huh. Lou Heffner, man. Shout out, Lou Heffner, bro. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Yeah, you already know it is. Typical rapper shit when they say, you already know, maybe you don't know. Yeah. My name Lou Hefner. I'm from Staten Island, Astoria, Queens. Uh-huh. But circumstances in life made me move to every borough. You know, when you growing up, you got to live in, not you have to, but my circumstances, I lived in every borough. So they called me the New York ambassador. I got the nickname from D-Rock, April Butler, and Puff. They was like, yo, Lou, can you get this for me in the Bronx? I'm like, yeah, I get that for you. Make a call, get that phone. Can you do this? Can you do that? And I was doing it, making it happen. So now I'm here with you guys in That's Jersey. Yourself. So I'm just yeah. expanding my family, you know. So we here with it. We here, man. Ain't yeah. got no job. You heard? Speaking of that, ain't got no job. Ain't got no job. Speaking of that, though. This mic sound kind of crazy. You good? Uh, it mic check, weird. mic check. I hear you. I hear you. Oh, I straight. Hear you. Yeah, you good. You good. Pause. But um, yeah, yeah. As y'all can see, we got a lot of products on the table here, not sponsored by anything. You feel me? <laughs> no, not but, at all. We just gotta show that we. You yeah, know. you know what I mean. We we real stabilized and sanitized in this motherfucker right now. Right, fact, it's a fact. lot of shit going on, but this shit is crazy. It's getting crazy about the day. Like I thought this shit was gonna subside by now. Like, how y'all feel about this shit? Like, what's the fuck going on, man? We living in li- history. Mm-hmm. This is history. Mm-hmm. You gonna yeah, see man. this in the history book and, mm-hmm. and just remember how you carried yourself through this time. But how strong are we? How know. strong are we? For real. Like, how strong? How many people going to fall? I seen some people fold. Like, some people like, I ain't got no money. I ain't got no food. I ain't got no toilet paper. Man, you you inno- you an innovator. You you born to survive. Your, your instincts got to kick in. You got to know, like, oh, I ain't got no toilet paper. Wash my ass. Get, mm-hmm. get your ass, get your dirty ass in the shower. Mm-hmm. But make make a way, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Nah, if you fold fact. in front of your family, in front, yeah. let me, I'll be damned I fold in front of my kids. Nah, that's so a my fact. wife, that's and she fact. like, we ain't got no food, what? Or, or somebody say, we ain't got no food, my make kids, anybody. Yo, nigga mm-hmm. told me, he was like, yo, I was speaking to somebody over through text message, right? Mm-hmm. We was talking, he was like, yo, basically he was telling me, yo, it's going to be a bumpy ride. I'm like, yo. My nigga, it's kind of been a bumpy ride my whole life, my nigga. Like, I really, like, <laughs> like this ain't really about that nothing, really. Like, you word, feel me? Like, like, of course, you know, nobody want to get sick and no shit like yeah, that. Right. But as far as everything else, like, uh, okay. Hey, well, you like, we'll through this yeah, one again. Like, I know how to survive. You you like, we'll get through this one, <laughs> yeah, you feel me? Yeah, I, I bet this, you want to trade this for slavery. I bet yeah, that shit like, I bet, yeah, you, bet that shit like Yeah, you know, word up. Yeah, heard. Motherfuckers so just sitting been, at home. You know we've been through worse, so you know this shit sound like, man. I mean, we've you been got... through worse now. Right, we've been yeah, through worse right, now. Right, like right. we 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 gamble every day. We step out that house because right. of because yeah, it is. We step black. out the house. They say, "Freeze, stop. Let me check you." This, that, and the third, or or oppositions. You know, sometimes it be our own people. You know, you can't mm-hmm. you can't blame other people. I'm not about to sit here and blame other people for anything. You know what right. I'm saying? Because some people will blame their mothers and be like, oh, my mom wasn't here, my father wasn't here. Your mom's father, whoever, ain't make you choose the path you chose. You chose the path on your own. So right. as a man, you you have the options. You're given everything you need. You're given everything you need. You mm-hmm. got two arms, mm-hmm. two yeah, legs, everybody. two eyes, two nose. You know, right. those th- these are things you're given. What are you going to do with it? People... People look at people like that, like people in the news and politicians, and they look at them as like, yo, they know what they talking about. They not human and shit like that. But as we see, your man, what's my man's name that got caught down in Fort Lauderdale? Uh, what's his name? Andrew, Andrew Gilliam. Gilliam. Yeah. Something like Andrew that. Andrew Gilliam. Yeah. The Florida governor, I mean, got caught down there, I mean. In the in hotel, in a, right? Yeah, I mean. <laughs> With, what uh, he got caught overdosing, like overdosing. Man, in they, a... they found all type of prescription drugs, um, met, uh, crystal meth, uh, erectile dysfunction, <laughs> shit like that. Man, what the fuck? Oh, that's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What the fuck yeah. type of shit he was doing in there? In the hotel. In the hotel room. He doing too much. With a gay male escort, like, roll oh, out, shit. 
He wow. jumped so out look, the window. You know what? This this <laughs> virus, this situation, everything we're going through right now, going going to show you people for who they are. True like, colors. You know what I'm saying? You're going to be up. looking at Niggas them. Is crazy. You heard? You're going to be looking at them like, really, this is who you are? You see uh. people panic. You Us being where we come from and things we do, we see people in situations where they panic. And when we see them in a crisis, we be like, <laughs> you just be looking at them like, you in a crisis, and, crack. and this is what you're going to do. Yo, mm -hmm. How you explain that to your kids, though? Like, you in a, like you got all nah. this type of shit in the hotel room with this male escort. Like, how they you, you going to explain that to nigga, your kids? Then they took pictures of you, too, like, though. You feel me, though? Dang, that nigga. But these are the people who are in charge of, of millions of people at a time. Yes. Like, these are the people that's being elected in but the nah, office. But nah, it's crazy. You know what it is with him, though? He got so close to being a governor. And, I mean... After that, they were sitting there waiting with a little, little cocky mess escort dude up in there. He, 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 my man passed out all high, whatever you on and shit, and he just, and somebody take pictures of them shit and leave them shit to the press. Like, that's what happened to him. Like, do, do we expect anything less from a human? No, he's, we shouldn't. He's human. We you know shouldn't. what I'm saying? Uh, uh, uh. Like, you know who, you know who I, I admire? Oh. You. Him. You. You know why I admire y'all? Because y'all working through adversity, y'all working through whatever situations y'all got, mm. consistency, like, this is not his first show. We on episode 27, right? 27. 27. This is 27. 27. Like, uh, and I, I'm, this destiny, you know what I'm saying? Like, nobody tells you, hey, hey, yo, stop. We about to make history. Nobody says that. At all. Nobody uh, says that. It just happens. It that flows. History happens, you know? Yeah. And, yeah. and just look back on it and be like, damn. Like we did that. I tell you, I tell you right now, I don't do interviews. I don't, I don't do mm -hmm. interviews. I don't like speaking. If I speak to you personally, I might get real deep on people, and we'll have that intimate conversation amongst each other, mm -hmm. and that's it. It's not recorded. It's not for TV. Mm -hmm. But when I do uh, interview, it's a thing for me because I know the legacy and what I built for myself and I'm not going to say it downplay like yeah you know man I ain't really do nothing nah I did I did some things I did a lot of things but speaking of did some things like how you get your start in music type shit like coming up out there in the city cuz we know it was it was a different vibe you feel me oh like coming up from New York City as as a rapper like I would think it's a whole different thing like oh, I, facts. I like like I imagine what it what it's like to be a rapper from from New York? Well, like, I mean, like, you probably got, I, I look at it as you got more, like, opportunities to be around people and shit like that. Like, nah, I yeah. suck. It I was coming like up that. in high school. There was these kids called the uh, SAS, the London Boys. They were the. the I heard them. Oh, they used to do dip set, right? Yeah, yeah. They, were, they were nice. They lived in Staten Island. They were banging with the homies. And, and, and they were, like, real situation, real things. So I would get in a cypher with them, get bodied, you know. I was never good at music, you know what I'm saying? I had a good story. Like, people felt my story mm -hmm. more than they felt the music and my personality or who I was. And then as I grew with the music, I became better. But my opportunities was more struggle. Like, when I worked for Bad Boy, I worked for Bad Boy twice. Like, meaning when they were coming up in the heyday, there was no, what was it? Bad, That's what um, I'm saying. Like, how you, how, how you get to work for Bad Boy in the, in the first place? I was in the street team. Saying? Okay. I was wearing a jumpsuit, throwing out, like, these little keychain things. Puff might not even remember that. And they used to give us, like, we used to pile in this paddy wagon and take us to, um, uh, what you gonna call it? Uh, what's this shit called? Uh, Justin's? Justin's, This yeah. restaurant. Yeah. And we used to eat for free and shit. And when we ate, it was on him, and then he sent us home. We wasn't getting paid. It was something you just did. Oh yeah, yeah. The street team you know, they get paid. Yeah. I was on the street team, and then I then I moved over to G Unit th through my man Jimmy G Unit. He put me up there. Then I moved over to Rock Nation. I was I was messing with Rock Nation back when State Property was popping. Mm. So I met this dude named Vaughn Smith, and from meeting Vaughn Smith, I slid over, and 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 just. Faded to black, like I ain't see him no more. And then I circle back some years later. We meet up again, do business again. You know what I'm saying? Every everything I learned from this music business, I've been burned. You know what I'm saying? Like I ain't never get a good handout. I ain't never get somebody to be like, "Yo, you the one." You know what I'm saying? I had to make a way. Mm -hmm. If I wasn't selected, I had to 
make myself select it. And that's what you know. What I'm hearing is like you, 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 you have a skill to network. You have a skill mm-hmm. to be able to navigate. Mm-hmm. You know, even if this is blocked, right, I'm gonna go this way. I have to. And I'm gonna find my way. I have to. I don't want to be the best. I want to be the best. I don't want to be the greatest. I don't want to be the king of New York. I don't want. That's why I call myself the ambassador. The name was given to me, by the way. Mm-hmm. And and my my stage name is Lou Hefner. Another name that was given to me. Anything that I got that was stamped in. So, approved was given to me anything that i had to build and design i had to make that so mm-hmm. in this business people feeding for a deal and i tell people i tell kids like younger kids like what is a deal alone what is a deal like right. you 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 got to pay that back i said i'm the deal mm-hmm. there, there's nothing no record label could give me that i ain't got already i'm the business uh. facts Fact, <laughs> i'm the brand and this the brand I'd rather be here than on Hot 97. You know why? Because Hot 97 had their turn. Power 105 had their turn. Everybody had their turn. And them guys so, are employees. Word, guys. word. This, yeah, facts. Facts. I'm, I, I don't talk to middlemen. I talk to bosses. You know what I'm saying? I talk right, to right. y'all. Mm-hmm. We 212. We kick it. We figure things out. Like, he could have been like, nah, not this week. <laughs> we booked. Y'all, y'all stay booked. He could have been like, nah, nah, I'm not in the mood for you. Mm-hmm. He the boss, you the boss, you the boss. He'd be like, y'all That's like, yeah, come up. Come up. Right. Make it happen. We ain't got to talk to nobody. Yeah. Right. We talk right. to each other. Jesus Juan for that, baby. Thanks, Jesus, Jesus Juan. Word. Salute to that, man. Marv, Marv the man. Marv, Marv the carbon. Oh, Shout out to Marv. Yeah. Shout out to Marv. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They were doing this thing, yeah. boy. Shout out to Marv, the unsung hero of the show. Word. Yeah, but I don't never get on the camera. Of all the bro. shows. Word, word, word. Shout out to Marv, man. Word. Without him, without y'all, there's no this. This is a platform. So when artists, I don't care if you, Jay Z, if Jay Z don't step foot in your room, or 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 any other artist, Nas, anybody, I don't care. I'm just throwing names out, mm-hmm. and I'm saying the best because the best should step foot in this room. They miss out. We don't miss out. Y'all made history with Hot 97, but guess what? You got to continue to make more history. Mm, mm, if you're not making more history, it, it's cool. He had his legacy, right? He got be he got Beyonce, right? But can you take a can you take an average girl and make a Beyonce? Mm. Can you take an average man and make another Jay Z? Mm. They would have right. did it. They would have did it. You know right. what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. You employ you employ people who come from um, all these smart schools and. And, and family backgrounds or friends of family, which I'm not opposed to you employing your friends, cousins, nephews, brothers, uncle. Mm-hmm. But, yeah. but, you know, but That's can you take somebody land. you don't know off the street, give them a job and say, yo, this your job. Mm. This your job. This your job. This is what you do. Maybe they getting paid less. Maybe they ain't getting paid. That's more. why I respect Nip so much, man. Nip was real. But you know, that I was respect real. Hope for recognizing people. that through through Nip. I, yeah. I I give respect. I give flowers. You know what I'm saying yeah. to certain people. But at so who you think deserve flowers in the, in the, in, the, in the rap game as far as let's talk about who New don't York. deserve flowers. Oh, let's get to that. Mm. Who, who, Casanova, who? you don't deserve flowers. He don't deserve flowers. Why you mm-hmm. think Cas? You put you flowers. you project the wrong image for us. You misleading us. You, you, he's a born leader. You know what I'm saying? I, I expect more from that man. You know what I'm saying? When I see you outside saying, we outside, no coronavirus, da 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 But, man, you said that? Tell, us, tell us the dangers of coronavirus. Seriously. Preach, preach mm-hmm. to us the facts. You know, don't mislead the kids. You know, that's the worst thing you could do. That's worse than pu- pulling a gun. You know what I'm saying? Misleading the youth. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So... I think, think he, niggas is trying to do that just to get a check and shit like that. I mean, you can do whatever you want shit. for clout. You know what I'm saying? I'm, yeah. I'm a man of respect. I don't, I don't deal with. And no that's clout. what you know. I was a fan of his music until like I actually seen that stuff. Even his so music is separate. His music is separate, but at the same time, as an individual, as a man, what do you do? It was like a little disrespectful because like I got loved ones that's affected by this coronavirus. He does. He does certain things and says certain things. Like first of all, I live by a model. I, I designed this model called. Jealousy is the new motivation. Okay. Jealousy, the new motivation. Because if you didn't have, it's some good jealousy, some bad jealousy. If you don't have the jealousy in your heart, you won't design certain things. Like he had jealousy towards six nine, so he came out with uh, uh, what is it? Color bang, yeah. set tripping, mm-hmm. set tripping. Shit, yeah. yeah. Had you not had that anger and that 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 mode, that gas, that fuel to make you make a song like that, you would have never made a song like mm-hmm. that. Mm-hmm. But so that's that's good jealousy. You know what I'm saying? You you took that anger and made something 
some a product that was that that was productive yeah, that shit for was you. Dope. I like you that know that what I'm saying? It was hard. You know what I'm saying? But I want him to take his voice and go harder, go above that. You know what I'm saying? Go above what, what you think you what you think you were only allowed to do. You you would hold. You be at the brunches. Yeah. I ain't never seen nobody at the brunch that was. A, a, a random face. I never see Hove give out. Ticket Not at say, all. I'm gonna go go to Newark and or, or go to the Bronx and say, "Here's a ticket. Here's a ticket. Hell Come no. to the brunch." You know what I think it be sometimes like when, when niggas making records and shit. Like they be trying to make the the record that's gonna pop and get the streams and that get that get the kids involved with all the ignorant shit. Yeah. But then I like if you listen to some niggas' albums, you probably get the album cut album track number seven or something. Mm-hmm. You probably got some insightful shit on there. You feel me? Yeah. yeah. Different sometimes you gotta yeah. Sometimes you gotta dig a little deeper. But I feel what you're saying. Like that shit. Like like the shit that's in the forefront is not the the positive shit. Yeah. Like like it needs to think, be. You feel like, what I'm saying? Let me recant my statement on Cass. I feel like. He can do more, and I feel like he's going to do more, but I'm not for the waiting, and I'm not for the yes, man. So who you know, else? And that just that statement turned me off. That yeah. was just, that was uncalled yeah, for. He was, just, yeah, he was just outside, like, uh, I'm outside, making fun of it. We, you know out, we outside, but we promoting news, and we promoting things, and we staying cautious. Like, the, you exactly. opened up, like, yo, look what we got. We not sponsored, but this is what it is, and this is what we're doing. Because this shit is serious And after now. this, I'm going straight back home. Yeah, it ain't, it ain't real. Lie. It ain't real until somebody you love get it. Exactly. This shit real serious right now. Right now we have ninety three thousand cases versus China that has what mm-hmm, mm-hmm. eighty one thousand cases. Mm-hmm. They've been through it. They 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 the ones who who had it first. So they 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 figuring things out faster than us because. I just can't wait this shit over, bro. Yeah, nobody can. Nobody can. Nobody can. Nobody can. But you gotta find other ways. Right, you gotta find yeah, other I ways. Ain't you know I saying? ain't really tripping, but I'm yeah. just like, like this is just stupid. Like, Especially yeah. for the kids, man. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? But you know what I noticed? It also made kids um, go outside. They 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 love to go outside now. Now they want to be outside. You heard? And you can't really be out there like that. Yeah. yeah. Now they want to talk to their friends. You heard? Like mm-hmm. not just on the phone. Mm-hmm. But I want to get back to the to the to the niggas that don't deserve the crown. Okay? Oh yeah, yeah, Let's yeah, get yeah. Back yeah. To that. A lot of the, the anything with a little in front of it, little pump, <laughs> little this, Them little that. Don't even Maybe count to me that. Talking about little pump, little yeah. pizza, little pizza. He, 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 he these, gonna regret that name in the, in a few right. years. Man. All these, little all pump. these. I feel wow. like this era gets so shocked. When some real shit happened, like <laughs> one of them gets shot, and they like, oh, he shouldn't have happened. He ain't never did nothing to nobody, not according to his music. You know, our, mm-hmm. God bless the dead. You know what I'm saying? When when you speak things into existence, they come they come true. You know what I'm saying? Some people don't don't deserve the hand they was dealt, but it's the hand you was dealt, and however mm-hmm. you play it. You know what I'm saying? I don't I don't fantasize and and and. And and uh and associate myself with with like you know finessing the experience of dying. I don't. Yeah, I, I don't do that. that. I don't. That whole you, ready to die type shit mm-hmm. with Biggie and all that. Mm-hmm. Like I ain't really. I remember you saying that, that before. Shit. Like you don't yeah, be like, on. I'd, I'd rather live my. I'd rather name my album "Ready to Live" or some shit. Mm-hmm. Like, mm-hmm. That's just me think, personally. You feel I think, me? Like, I think Tom. The times of his era was like his mind state. That shit. He was like everybody was go. You know, mm. I'm 36. That era, I wasn't the strongest, and I wasn't the pussiest, but I was on go. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Cause you had to be on go. And I'm from a borough that's that's very What borough are you from? Is Staten like, Island Staten, okay. Queens. Yeah. I'm from every borough, but the ones primarily Staten Island and Queens. So Staten Island got one ferry. At the time it was two movie theaters. It was like four Burger Kings. Mm-hmm. Like ten McDonald's. Staten Island gritty, boy. Ten McDonald's. They, 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 like gritty. Go they go got this... they got a real nice part though. Like, like yeah, of course, yeah, of everywhere, course. Everywhere, everywhere got that. Beautiful. Of course. Like, I was got out that. there. But it's what? it's a, it gritty. Like yeah, it's hard. I, 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 I ain't never been in that part. I ain't never been in that part. Gritty, boy. Imagine this. You on an island. Yeah. It's an island. There's two ways off the no, three ways. There's two bridges, one ferry. So you shoot somebody. You live next door to the nigga. Who shot your man? And then you gotta go to the store. You see him at the store. You ride it. You die. And then 
make matters worse, you on a forty five minute bus ferry boat ride with him. And 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 you love this man. You you forty five minutes y'all staring at each other till you ready to throw him over the over the thing. Every mm-hmm. fight we had on that ferry boat, the the objective was to throw you over the water thing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's why there was that's why there was police there all the time. And then that's why we would shake out at the ferry terminal at the at the um the the bus thing. I forgot what they call that shit. I've been I've been going for a minute from there. But they had like the 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 terminal where the buses go. If you run into the bus and you just running to get home and then you get on a bus and you see that man. Mm-hmm. Cause that's how close it is. Connected too is close, an mm-hmm. too close. And then you in the mall Christmas, you shopping. You could go to the little mall, or you gonna go to the big mall. Mm-hmm. Now you nice gonna go to the big there. mall, and you see this person that you was Wu Tang Clan. Like when I seen that documentary, or like that whole thing what they did, Shout Shout in, the, the, series, yeah, yeah, yeah. the series, it shed light on that. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Like you know what I mean? Brothers was like actually um beefing. Mm-hmm. Them dudes was beefing on yeah, each other, word, shooting word, at each word. other, and they live right there. They seen each other every day. You feel me? To the point where that shit had to get squashed to make money. It you was, know what I mean? It, it's so real. Like I see so many things in my hood. Like one time, not God bless the day. I'm not gonna say names. Like, is it only two projects? In no, there? no, no. It's Atlanta, all a ten. Atlanta, Atlanta it's all a ten. Uh, Port Richmond, uh, Toad Hill, um, New Brighton, West Brighton. Park Hill, Stapleton. Mm. Um, it's so those many. Are, those are the two. Those are the two only things I know. Like, Bar- the yeah. Berry Homes. You can have a soft, of you can have a soft projects turn into a lot of projects because when they get older, they move out of their mom's crib and they get Section 8 and they in this project now. Now you got him setting it off in that project and now the drama's coming from this project to go to this project. It's just, it's mm. just too much. Mm. And then there's certain parts of Staten Island, the bus and the train don't go. So... You know what part that is, you know. Mm-hmm. But they have their separate situations. Like right now, they they have heroin, super addictions, and 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 pills. Yeah, opiate and crisis. It's all crazy. that shit. Yeah. So I think that shit everywhere. Everywhere. Yeah, but mm-hmm. now now it's a problem. Now 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 it's a a, a crisis because they are not crackheads. They have problems now. Yeah, but when it was they, crack, yeah, it was yeah. they were crackheads. You know that's nah, about. Nah, Billy nah, 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 you know that's people, about. Right? Yeah. You know word, that's word, about. Word, yeah. word. We we ain't never gonna, you you know, we ain't never you gonna break. We ain't never gonna break that until we start learning, whether the, the that side or this side learn. We both people. You exactly. know what I'm saying? Like people, people. Yes. Like right now, if an alien came down, he ain't gonna be like. Uh, you white, black, white, you black. He gonna be like, nah, <laughs> yeah. Human, but man. see, this is the question. Yeah. Like going, you know, talking about ethnicity and everything. Why do you know? Why is it uncommon for black businesses to succeed though? Because I don't know. Shit, because just don't fuck with niggas like that. Uh uh-uh. uh Nah, I ain't it's true. not that. It's not that. We we not educated in the in the in the um, loopholes to certain things like like tax exemptions mm-hmm. and and things that we need to know. And if you don't have, like me, I'll put somebody on. I'll, me holding jewels from you being successful is one thing. When somebody don't tell you how to do something, mm-hmm. they right. scared of you. Right. They oh, they yeah. afraid of yeah. you. They afraid you are gonna succeed more than I them. get that all the time. Mm-hmm. I, I get the hell all the time. Yeah. Share the game. People don't like this shit. <laughs> Yeah. Well, the, game. the world is abundance, yeah. man. I'm yeah, but you're right about that. that. You got to have a good tax team. You got to have good lawyers. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That, too, will will help out with the business, but it's it's still more than that. You but know, if, you're not, to, if you're not, I'm sorry to cut nah, you off part so. Nah, Go I, I was going to say, I think it's more so black business. I think it's like more so is funding. Like, because if you got the funds, like every business take at least two years to, for you to supposed to survive it. Allegedly, so anyway, that's what they say. And anyway. five years to be successful. How about this? Yeah. How about this? Whatever we do for money, you got a hundred. You got a hundred. I got a hundred. He got a hundred. We got four hundred dollars right now. Mm-hmm. Who know about Susu? You know about a Susu? Nah. A Susu is when a group of people put money in a pot. It's like a West Indian thing, or or uh, like they put money in a pot. And you and, get it for that money. You and, get yeah. Uh, I know yeah, 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 yeah. But they don't. They don't think like that. You know what I'm saying? If 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 I go to jail today, I'm getting out. You know what I'm saying? If if something happened to me today, it's covered. You know what I'm saying? Because I was thinking about 
what people ain't think about. Some people talk about that. Oh, you stack money for lawyer fees. Did you really? Or Did does it really? sound nice? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Who Who's your lawyer? What's his number? Is he on retainer? Mm -hmm. what, these are questions that some of them don't even... If do you, you said, stay in contact? Do you text them? Do you talk like... Yeah, you know yeah, what I mean? yeah. Mm -hmm. I talk to my lawyers. Me like, too. Like, we best right. friends. We you best friends, for real. Yeah. Like, so you better be. We could talk be on, he'd be like, I'm taking this on the arm for you, you heard? So, mm -hmm. like, but not the... I'm promoting violence or promoting, but I'm talking about any situation. It could be a fender bender. It could be a fender bender turned into a homie. It could be anything. Uh, it yeah, could be that anything. Happen. Uh, that you know what I'm saying? Happen. Yeah, yeah, I seen a couple of Road Rage videos uh, this week. Yeah, people, mm -hmm. Road Rage is bugging. Even my, with the corona. Once again, shit. God bless the dead. One of my men, I'm not going to say his name, he just, he was on his way to work and a car hit him and he gone. And he was the breadwinner, the breadwinner, the only breadwinner. Wife would stay at home, I, I think. Don't quote me on that. But she, he was the breadwinner for mm -hmm. his kids, his wife, and now he's gone. Mm -hmm. Now what? Now what? Mm -hmm. Go for me. Mm -hmm. Go for me. That's uh, usually that's yeah. usually what happens. Fuck that. Unfortunately. Fuck that. That's why I said. That's why I stay from. Give me my money, man. man. Give my money. Stay <laughs> from. I, I need my money. There's three uh, axes. I need my money now. And my lawyer contacted you. See, but this, this, <laughs> this <laughs> like this coronavirus is fucking up everything. Not not only people everyday lives, but it's fucking up like sports and all that. Like we ain't got oh, no definitely. sports right now. So uh, we ain't got no strip no clubs. Game, but we ain't got nothing. But video game. This is a, this, this <laughs> is like a adult punishment right now. But real quick, like I want to know, like the uh, like y'all think we gonna get the NBA back this year? No. No? I think so. so. I think if anything, no, it's it's gonna be delayed until like August or something, so and then they might even go just straight to straight to the playoffs type. Or thing? they might just fail, uh, for go. NBA, somebody gonna get hurt. They do that. You can't even go to the nah, I don't. Bad, I don't know. NBA I don't think so though. Bro. I feel like, I feel like it's it's as serious as we make it. It's as cautious as we make it. It's as needed. You know, the same person who who promotes. The frenzy is the one who gives you the pill. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The same person who this this in every politic, a good crisis makes for a good political stuff. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, they need a good crisis. I get all of that shit, but my whole thing is that they going a little too far. Like they really going far with this one. That like, liability. You think you gonna you gonna world. you gonna let people play in your arena? And they catch that coronavirus. Now I'm suing the Staples Center. Mm -hmm. I feel like this: if nurses and and That's nurses, ability, bro. if nurses and doctors catch the coronavirus, why don't they immediately go on workman's comp? Uh, why this, they caught it at your job? This right? Shit is iffy. Whatever you want to like, what whether it is whatever it is is not what they're saying. It's either worse or it's not. It's not bad at all. We don't. We don't know. That's what I think. We don't know. Yeah, I, I think. think this I just shit think is they're super not, crazy, <clears throat> or it's nothing. They're not letting us know. We don't know. We it, don't know, bro. This like, whole playing the middle shit they talking about. I don't know what the fuck going on. Man. This shit is retarded. But we know it's tanks getting shipped all over the you country. Know, you know what this we need what to know? Saying. We need to. We need to educate ourselves on the facts. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Not run the news and 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 all these media outlets. Like even us, we media outlet talking about it. But what are the actual facts? You and that's what, what I do. I like I got that shit from Bloomberg. You here's know, a, I go to the Bloomberg for the everything in the morning. You know what I'm saying? Here's what I mean by actual fact. I know a girl who just contracted the corona. She works in a hospital. They said, Oh, you mm. well, if you don't have a uh, fever and and you you tested positive for corona, um, you can report back to work in seven days if you don't have a fever. That's a fact. How long it take for you to get the fever and all that shit though? Who knows? Yeah. Who knows? Um, Who knows how how dormant it is in our body? Who knows what it is? I have a saying. I have a family member is showing the symptoms, and mm -hmm. the doctor is saying if you don't have a fever, <clears throat> we're not gonna put you on the list at mm -hmm. this moment. You know what I'm saying? Like it's mm -hmm. it's crazy, but he he can have it the whole time. It's crazy. You, you know who feel very safe right now? The them them doomsday preppers. That nigga crazy, man. That nigga crazy. That nigga is set. Like, uh, they've been preparing for this their whole life. They right? set. Like they was like, I told y'all, motherfucker, something was coming. Them niggas is set. What you about to say though? Like, nah, the, the the vegans, like 
vegans are probably set too. They ain't yeah. got all that vitamin C shit they eat. Yeah. Mm. Like you think you think being vegan is like you think that make you live longer? Is no, no, I don't eat meat. So, I, but I eat fish. Um, the pescatarian, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I don't know what they inject into meat because when I went to Haiti and I did a show out there, I ate meat out there. I was fine. Came home, ate meat, shitting like crazy. Mm. But it's what they put in it's the meat. It's probably what they put in the meat. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Inject. It's like it's it's everything you get when you're getting it and when you're doing it or it, circumstances. That Haiti circumstances are not like American circumstances. Definitely not. They, yeah, food is not as, you know, it's fresher because they got to grow it. They got to make it. Instead of having Anjamama syrup, I'm having um, honey. Instead of having white sugar, I'm having brown sugar. Instead of juice, I'm having cherry juice. Like mm. certain juices, certain foods I'm having, and I felt better. Mm. The sun was hitting nah, me the right way. Fact. Certain nah. things hold. I I, I, be, I believe in holistic um, medicines and shit like right. that. I really think that's type of shit. But I think whatever you got in the earth, it, like you got something there that's, that that could cure it. Like you just gotta come. It, it, like it's up to you to get the knowledge to come up with the right combination this, of that I shit. I put this. Like, I put this. Me? I put this on you, right? It's on you, right? I could take it off you. That's my observation of any disease. If you can get it, why can't you get rid of it? If I put something on you, why can't I take it off of you? This the biggest rock in the fucking world could get taken off of you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You could chisel it down. You could you could blow it up. It might be some repercussions to chiseling it. It might take too long and you're gonna die. But you could blow it up. It might blow up and then blow you up. Mm -hmm. But it was on you. It can get off of you. So how do you get it off? That's the question. There you go. That's the question. It's simple. Some Get people... some sea moss, people. Yeah. Yeah. Sea moss, Irish, Irish, yeah, Irish moss. Nah, you got the sea moss gold from my man King Ernie. <laughs> <Cut. Cut. Cut. laughs> <laughs> it's about... called Irish moss, too. I didn't Irish know that. Moss. This is Jamaican How about shit. They call it Irish moss. At my man King Ernie, man. For King Ernie. Go, go, go highlight yeah. King Ernie. Get some sea moss. Warm green tea. Warm green tea. Warm green tea. Green tea, too. That shit make you piss like a motherfucker. That's how you know it work for something. That shit make you piss like a motherfucker. What about these strippers and these rappers paying these people to show they they private parts on the, um on Instagram. on Instagram and stuff like that? They holding the tea up and shit, right? Yeah. So if I don't think we think in longevity, I think we think in entertainment right now, which is nothing wrong with adult entertainment. But I think there's a place, and in and in, in the world is watching us right now. Oh yeah, and, and mm -hmm. I think the kids are watching us right now. What you do? I, I don't think there's a normal thirteen year old anymore. Like you can, I used to. We used to identify with younger kids by the way they dress and they sneakers. Now they come out the womb and they like, I gotta be fresh. I gotta have this. I gotta have that. I never met a normal kid. That was just like I just want to play, I just want to chill. Play no maybe, maybe five, six, mm -hmm. they still playing. Maybe, but I. But it's also what you feed your kids. Yeah, but you Facts. don't see it nowhere like mm -hmm. that no more. Like back in the day, motherfuckers used to be. I think it's technology, like cause, like motherfuckers ain't have the phone or like crazy video game technology like that to be like to take our attention away like oh, that yeah. like so football outside was still more the fun the information and going is to digested. ride your bikes and shit like that was still more fun than staying in the house now they got so much technology it's crazy. that is is more fun to stay in the yeah. house than it is to go ride your bike and these right. kids is doing things at an advanced pace like my kid is they 7 play years with the iPad. he's 7 years old he does C++ program he started doing that he doing he building his own little Minecraft world in a virtual world at seven years old, bro. Yeah. Like, uh, that's crazy. That's like, bananas. that's bananas, bro. Like, at seven, I, I was taking two toys and hitting it together. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> we just building Hulk bikes. Smash. Hulk smash. <laughs> Word. <laughs> so, crazy. building bikes and shit. So, it's that what you feed shit. them. The longevity of these strippers, though, like, and, and they putting out their. Some of these, strippers. some of these Stop. strippers are mothers. They, they bugging out here, too. They actual mothers. And, and you showing your lady man, parts. No. Like, remember, like, if you found out your man's man, mom was old. the freak of the neighborhood, oh, man, that's it was over for oh, you. Man. But now everybody moms is oh, the freak man. of the world. You know Damn. what I'm saying? So, so 
Where's the queens at? Look Dude. at the fans only, right? You keep saying Yo, fans word. only. Look at that. <laughs> they said they making what two hundred k. Them girls uh, born in two hundred k. That's some that's, bull. That, that's good money. That's good to help. But see how it's happening though. You let see me, how it's happening. Me, I don't. I don't believe. I think that's short money because they gotta live up to a lifestyle. They gotta have those Yeezys. They gotta have the matching lime green outfits that weave down to their back. The they injections. Got all that. <laughs> <laughs> They gotta they have all that. Do. It's like they equipment. Do. It's like a basketball. It's like a football player. He gotta have his shoulder pads, his helmet. This bitch gotta have the the, the titties and 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 the hour shaped glass. It all on Instagram. And guess what? Fast forward some years later, they're gonna be looking at little little Terrence. Just using a name. If, sorry if your name is Terrence out there. <laughs> little Terrence. Little Terrence. Like yo, your mom's. Back in the day, it was wild. She was on fans only, and that's a fact. Or when they get in a rap battle, they're gonna be like, "Little Terrence, your mom's was back in the day, fans only." But guess what? We ran in your mom's, hundred deep, fans <laughs> only. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Uh, rap battle and shit. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. But. That stuff is gonna have a lasting impression on this yeah. young man. Cause motherfuckers <laughs> recorded that, put that shit straight on X video of Pornhub. <laughs> Niggas is recorded Porn, that shot. Pornhub community. Like, nah, right? for real. Like they recording that interaction with that girl. They recording that shit and putting it online, and that's how it's, it's traveling. There's no yeah. integrity. So, so it's, it's over. It's, it's gone now. Even if you take it down from fans only, it's. All over the internet. And you got Facts. some shit like that on the internet. You wonder why yeah, a, a dude life. can't take you serious and shit like I don't, that. I don't want to take away. I don't want to. I don't want to act like I'm a. I'm a. I'm. I'm fully against it. You know what I'm saying? Not. Not. Not some women that I don't know. I know certain women who got fans only. You know what I'm saying? They got to get it how they live. You know what I'm saying? But ain't nothing wrong with it. To me. it I'm just ain't saying. nothing wrong with yeah. it. But I'm just saying no. The repercussions. If you cool with the repercussions, apparently they cool with the repercussions. That's it. But some of them act like they no like I. Right, but fuck. but grow from that. That's all I'm saying. Just like I said to, about Casanova, grow from that. Once you get the bag, what you gonna do with the bag? I get what you're saying because Cardi B did it. She 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 was like she a, got the bag and she and she, she grew from yeah, the bag. Right. Sometimes mm -hmm. we don't we don't take her serious because she talk about coronavirus. <laughs> or, or or she joking around, but there's there's truth in every joke. So you think mm -hmm. talk about the bad? You think uh, Nicki Minaj is gonna grow from that hundred million? Nicki, she got that hundred. Oh, well, she she got a lot of sex offenders around her though, man. That's the creepy shit about her though. Like, Who though, don't man. got sex offenders around them? But we yeah, surround them. You got a point there. How many, how many, couple how many uncles, how many uncles cousins ain't get caught? Not saying that I'm for yeah. sex offenders. Definitely not for any man with no kids. You heard? Yeah. But there's some people that it starts with us policing our own community, saying, right. "Listen, you're wrong, homie. You're wrong, but that don't happen. You're wrong, that ain't happening. Ain't nobody g checking ain't nobody, nobody no that. more. But that you know what? No you know, know soon that happens. So you do that though. Somebody, in the, somebody else in that family that love that family, despite what they did, gonna jump in the middle of that shit. Ain't gonna let you do it. But so guess what? Guess what? Integrity. And 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 leadership and also accountability. Right, like right. if if I have to have the leadership enough to know that I'm gonna withstand any fire, just like that stripper gonna know that she gotta withstand any fire that's gonna come after the effect. So right now, he did wrong. I know you wrong, son. Hmm. Ain't nothing in the world. I don't care if I have to take the consequences, but you wrong. And if you can't take accountability for that, we have to take accountability for letting that slide, you heard? Mm -hmm. So if if we let everything slide, if we play too cool, we're going to lose. We can't mm -hmm. be too cool. We got to win. This this is the name of the game, win. Mm -hmm. uh, win, win, win. I don't know when niggas get caught and glorify going to jail. Yeah, a lot of niggas do that. that, that that's Some like a whole shit. Yeah. That's yeah, like a I, thing. I told you before, like, man. You feel me? I, I, when it's that jail shit, man, you get, but my book, you I, I always get niggas points for staying out that motherfucker. I don't get nobody points for <laughs> going in there. No, nah, you right. Uh, yo, uh, speaking of jail, though, yo, who would you release, yo, from jail because of the. Hold on. I want to get. That's a yeah. question. Muscle team hold fun. on. Hold on. We, we going to do. <laughs> shout out to Hustle Team. <laughs> that's nigga funny as hell. We can get into that. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> 
We we we, we gonna switch that question up real because we ain't do a would you rather in a minute. Oh, yeah, so we, we, gotta we, we do gonna that. turn that into a would you rather, right? I would love to do that because that's this is funny. So this is how up. we this is how we do it, right? I'm gonna give you a a scenario. You pick the best choice, not made for your life. This is how we gonna do it. So if you had to trade places with one of these four people and the coronavirus would go away, which person would it be? We got Harvey Weinstein. You gotta become this person, R. Kelly, Bill Cosby, or Takashi Six Nine. Who wanna go first? Who train places? Or you, or you gonna let the coronavirus run rampant? I I would have to trade places with them. Yeah. So so it's Harvey Weinstein, Bill Cosby, Takashi Six Nine, and R. Kelly. Okay, R. And R. Kelly. Yeah. So I, I'm gonna take I'm gonna take Bill Cosby. Oh, man. You know why? Cause he's done more for. Our community and our society, other than just dropping a pill and some shorty drink some years ago, you know what I'm saying? Like that. That's definitely a scumbag move if he did it allegedly. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We going off for. Let me ask you a question. Look at all these women that say he did that. Look at them. I know. Look at them. Look at their. Not. Not. not I don't want to bring race into anything because I, I. That's not a crutch. Nah, but I, I know what you're saying because yeah. all of these people on this list is like, like we the only one. Bill Cosby is the only, only one with kind of still like, ah, yeah. like because even if like I, I, I don't like he did it or whatever. It was I don't messed know. up. But it do you think he up. slipped a, a Mickey in all them bitches drink? Nah, I probably not. All. Come on. Come on. Come on. Not on. How not many on. of our leaders? are going to get caught up in some shit, and if they can't get caught up in some shit, they get killed. How many of our leaders yeah. we got to keep sacrificing? Okay. How many of them are the sacrificial lambs for our culture all the time, no matter what? Keep so doing check. It, keep doing check. Like, honestly, That's just how it is, though. He lived it really a lot is. of lives, though. Like, Bill Cosby, he went from just being, like, a, a regular up-and-coming comedian and actor, whatever he was doing, he was becoming, vulgar. He was vulgar with the comedian shit too. He to was, becoming who he was on on TV, and then, and then retiring from that, becoming a, a philanthropist and all of this, and now shit, he get to live the life of a, of, a, of an inmate. So he like shit. He probably looking at. But who, he call it the palace and shit. He be chilling in there. Who appointed him? These the people appoint him these titles of who he is. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, right. And then and then. Who are who are the people calling him a rapist? Who are these people? What, like, what credibility do these people have? You know what I'm saying? Because these are the same people that we fast forward in time and find out they messing with kitty porn. You know what I'm saying? You 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 keeping your dirt low, and then you gonna how you gonna judge this man? And 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 then. You talking about some years ago. And yeah. if this would have happened, some people say, well, he had a lot of money and he could withstand the cracks. Okay. Okay, so then get him then. Yeah. You waited till he was this old and he was doing stuff for— But Bill Cosby could have—he should have known. He should have known. They going to always come after you, brother. Yeah. Regardless what you do. That's why I think it happened to that governor we was talking about earlier. You feel me? Like they Once they don't need you, they, they embarrass you. That's why I, I got a feeling— Something bad gonna come out about Obama in a couple of years. Like, watch, like, mark my words though. Like, you feel me? He's like, they don't need him no more. Like, once they don't need him no more, they gonna say something. They gonna just... So, who you going with, Bill Cosby, too? Mm, yeah, I'm there. taking Bill. I'm taking every, Bill. Every man, yeah. every man in this room got a vice. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And and whatever your vice is, it, some some like the drink, some like women, some like, some like, uh, fucking feet fetishes or whatever they like, you know what I'm saying? No man on this earth is perfect and no man is exempt from the punishment that you're going to receive from doing your dirt. Yeah. You're going to get that one day. I'm going to play so, devil advocate. I'm going to pick Takashi 6 now. Nah, you don't That's want that. Right. You don't want and I, no, that. No, 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 no. I don't want that, right? See, want but think about, this. Think, think about this. think about this. I don't want that. But think about this, yeah. right? Think about this. This is the, my approach towards it, right? I don't agree with what he did, right? Yeah. That shit is you can't foul. Be That's foul. Yeah. That's foul. But I, what I would do getting released is change the whole energy of my my approach. Now I will come talk to, to kids. I'll talk to them about Jeff. But the kids ain't going to want to hear you. Yes, you know they not. They not. But you got to keep pressing. You got to keep pressing. Come out oh, with books. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, like, but see, think, look, Takashi not going to do that. Takashi not going to come out on some social awareness, 
Um, yo, you I know mean, what I mean? I False identity. I should have mm-hmm. never. I wasn't never a street guy to begin yeah. with. You know what I'm saying? I I, I played into the. He not gonna come out like that. He mm-hmm. not gonna come out like that. And that's why I say I'll pick him because that's how I would come out. You know what I'm saying? Well, in that situation. You just to play devil advocate because okay. everybody's picking Bill you Cosby. Play, you can play devil nah, advocate, nah. but you're just gonna be the devil, no advocate. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> you're not gonna be Takashi Six Nine. You're never gonna be Takashi. No, nobody in here ever. Gonna, no. There's there's morals and ethics to the way we raise and, and 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 the and, communities that we come from. Yes. Yeah. So what he did, he was he's, playing dangerous. He games. saw opportunity. <laughs> dangerous. I'm blessed. Okay. I was blessed to be around and we had Shadi and all of them in, in the building. You know what I'm saying? They mm-hmm. came up to my facility. Mm-hmm. I know the inner dwellings of of somewhat of what they were interacting in. Takashi um fantasized about this lifestyle and, and he wanted to be see rappers get the bag and then they believe their music and who they are. And then once they start believing who they are, Mm -hmm. they forget there's nobody really out there to humble them. Excuse me, Poppy. There's nobody really out there to humble them and be like, yo, but guess what? I was that person for shoddy, and and I would be in his DM if I saw something that I didn't like and be like, yo, chill, son. What you doing? You know know what I'm saying? Like, you wilding, you heard? Like, why are you saying this on social media? You know the rules. You know mm-hmm. this is not what we do. That's why I say a lot of the times I would not jump on this this podcast or interviews. And, and when I do, I let it all out. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Because I'm trying to educate from my faults. I'm not saying I'm the best because I win consistently. Mm-hmm. I'm saying I'm the best because I took so many losses. You know what I'm saying? I got somebody doing 39 years. I got somebody doing 15 years. I got somebody doing three years. I got two of my cousins who just came home today. Mm-hmm. And they and they both FaceTime me from Duo. I don't even know what the fuck a Duo is because I got iPhone. Mm-hmm. So they hit me on a Duo. They like, yeah, they, they letting us out because of this damn coronavirus. They letting you out because it's beneficial to them. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Of course. Liability, liability. It goes all back to that. I ain't gonna let him out. Ain't no jobs out here from the go to right now. Word, word, word. Word. Yeah, you just you feel me? What the fuck? Un- unemployment they, what jumped to twenty percent. They bringing them them tanks. Shit. They bringing in all this unemployment shit. They know what's about to happen. They know we're about to have a, a, a depression. You know what I'm saying? They this is the weed out the weak jobs. Let's get let's weed these weak jobs out and fold them up, and we'll give them a little bit of money. The little bit of money ain't gonna be enough to 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 boost them back up. So they're gonna take that bread, they're gonna spend that bread, and they're gonna be happy with that bread. Mm-hmm. And 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 then the rest they gonna they gonna kill each other. And after they kill each other, the 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 other ones are gonna bunk up together. And then when they bunk up together, we'll hit them with violations. And then hopefully we weed out the ones we don't want. This is the weed out situation. Especially Especially for Trump planning, he 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 wants to use this as he saves the the day to get reelected, mm-hmm. right? We all know that. Like that's it's what just, I really think. Uh, yeah, it's it's a reelected oh, spot. On Sunday, Easter nah, Sunday, Easter nah, Sunday. Nah, this nah, is nah, take how you gonna nah, say nah, a virus <laughs> gonna be going on Easter Sunday? Exactly. That's a beautiful day. Exactly. We just gonna pick this day. Easter Sunday. But see, Sunday. what he really want to do when he gets reelected is flood the market. When I say flood the the currency, he wants to make more money. Yeah, right. Which that's gonna that might fold the economy even worse, bro. Cause mm-hmm. inflation, bro. Yeah, yeah. Dollar ain't gonna be worth shit. And ain't gonna be worth shit. So it's like it's a lot of shit that's happening. Like you can see it step by step. Like you say, you gotta educate yourself. You gotta be, you know, aware yeah. of that shit. Cause that shit, you know. But it, yeah, it's a, it's a lot of shit. It's a lot of shit, boy. Them niggas need to go. Them niggas need to figure out whatever they doing. They whatever money they getting, whatever money they racking up. Figure that shit out. And get this shit over with. So they just get back to what they doing. <laughs> so, yeah, that's God, it, man. Shit, this shit man. is crazy, Listen, man. man. Like, we gonna get, we gonna we get. Gotta to think, what would OJ think at the time? Like OJ Simpson. Man. I wonder what he think about the selfish? coronavirus. Selfish. OJ is selfish. Oh, OJ I'm OJ. Shit. Word. He, he, OJ he, Simpson he don't, think about the coronavirus. When, it, when the person say he not a color or race or anything, he goes, I ain't that. I'm OJ. He's saying I'm my own entity. I'm my own being. You think OJ killed his wife? No, yeah, I no don't. comment. He said, I don't. No I, comment. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. No <laughs> comment. Absolutely not. OJ <laughs> and I got and I got I got receipts too to prove I know that man ain't do it. Like you feel me? Absolutely not. He ain't kill that girl. Like you feel me? <laughs> <laughs> 
It was innocent. He, I mean, he was on some Uncle Tom shit. We get a juice. I mean, I mean, he, he, he is, but he ain't killing people though, like, man. He ain't killing, like, like that's a fact. Like, for oh, no, no, how, man. So, how, how you figure he ain't killing people? And where the receipts come from, man? All right, the restaurant, the restaurant that the old boy worked at, nobody talk about that shit, though. You know, a lot of people got killed that worked there, though. You mm-hmm. feel me? A lot of people don't know that shit, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, like, that motherfucker. You see, talking about, and, and the restaurant, nigga was selling coke out the restaurant, like, so you you talking about he she he, he bought her home the uh the motherfucker bring her glasses who leave her glasses at a restaurant yeah. and go to somebody's house you was bringing that girl coke yeah. and something went wrong in there you feel me <laughs> whatever happened in that situation bro like I mean I don't know you had somebody with you that's trying to rob you or whatever like they got can they kill that man or you feel me yeah. People look, I look at the restaurant that he used to work, they used to work for that she ate from. I swear to God, so people don't never talk about that shit though. Like the media just wanted like he was OJ did, OJ did, you that, know, OJ did that. You shit. know who we gonna have to answer to at the end of all this shit? I'm not super Jesus freak or super religious, but we're gonna have to answer to him. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And then if if you Everything is about a legacy in your past, what you leaving behind. Like, when I die, I want niggas to say, I did it like Lou did it. Or I did it like how society did it. I right. did it how Marv did it. Yeah, yeah. I did it how, how yeah. them did it, you know? At the end of the day, Kobe Bryant, when he left... He was Ooh, telling us before he left, he was screaming like, yo, what if you die tomorrow? Mm-hmm. That's like, that's what I think about, bro. As a man, I think you should you should aim for that picture but a butter fireplace, man. Mm-hmm. For mm-hmm. centuries. Right. Facts. You feel right. me? You gotta be the picture but a butter fireplace. Facts. For, for right. centuries, like, the like, like statue, but it, man. But it all it up, like, but it all start with us. Like when I see him, when I see you. I'ma speak prestigiously about y'all. You understand? Mm. Like, I'm not gonna downplay y'all. Mm. I'ma rock that hat. I'ma I'ma fuck with this brand. Fuck with this podcast. Mm. Fuck with Ma. Fuck with everybody. Even if there's some differences, somebody gonna look at me and see this show and be like, he weird. He said this and did that. Of course. You always gonna have that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, everybody but, gonna but guess everybody what? weird to somebody. But guess what? Yeah. It's how we treat each other. Like, I ain't gonna sit here and let somebody talk bad about high society. I'm gonna be like, listen, man, that's the best podcast better than high ninety seven power one five. I don't care if you say anything Appreciate different. That much love, I don't care man. if you say anything different. If you ain't on this show, you ain't on nothing. If you ain't right. if you ain't walk your feet in these rooms, you ain't friend. make history. Tell if you right. ain't do this Come and you ain't do that, you you ain't do nothing. Seriously. Right. You know what I'm saying? If you don't know it's him personally, I could pick up my phone and text son. I could right. text you for the hat. I could call right. him for the society, jewels and the bro. gems. You know right. what I'm saying? Nobody know everything. But if we keep our brothers in place of a on a higher platform, black, white, Chinese, anything, if we hold them to that standard, bro, we gonna be strength, we're gonna strengthen our unity because at the end of the day, it's us versus whoever is mm-hmm. gonna be the opposition to us progression. Yeah, and unity is king. Yeah, is power, yeah, yo. yeah. That yeah. shit is really is power. Yeah, but it's yeah. hard to get that right now, right? It's, it I mean, seems sometimes like you just gotta me the way I, the way I see it is you just gotta roll with the flow, man. Whoever you, you go on your journey, everybody gonna click up on the on the. You feel me? Whatever the end product is, your journey, my journey now. Exactly, like you feel All me? Right. Like he wasn't on the show in the beginning, and this is my this is my cousin. He wasn't even on the show in the beginning, but. I mean, it just ask me. Co- it co- ended up for him to be here. Your you cousin got a saying? great yeah. vibe. I came in, sat down. Most niggas and, and him too. They could have. What the fuck is you doing, saying? Nah, they yeah. vibe was like, have a seat. You, yeah, yeah. You Welcome, guess, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's get right. You know what I'm saying? When you have that that standoffish, trying to analyze, over analyze everything and yeah. everybody, <laughs> you, you starting off on the wrong foot. Yeah, oh, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right. Be guarded. Be militant. Protect yours, but you know danger when you see danger. Yeah, you know we we, we, we peas in them. You see peas. Yeah. We could smell it. Yeah. We could smell. We could smell a fraud. Yeah. We could smell a fraud. We could look a man in his eyes and know he frauded. Yeah. Well, just like you, you, when we first met, you invited us up to your facilities. Of course. You know? So tell the That's, people, tell the people about you know what I mean. What's going on uh, upstairs? Like where they could come 
Fuck well, with you at? My studio is the first ever smart studio. Like everything operated through my phone. Forgive me. That's why my phone keep going off. And and I could see everything, open doors, turn on lights, um, just pretty much function everything through the thing. And then I got like touchscreen coffee table, massage chairs, a Man. white room mm. for videos, photography, post production, and music, of course, we do. And then I'm proud of myself because I'm gonna be proud of myself before anybody else could say they're proud of me. I started this thing. We surrounded by something, even in this uh, podcast, we surrounded by acoustics. And then I thought to myself, damn, I could get those acoustics. I could get those acoustics. Mm -hmm. I don't want that. Mm -hmm. I want my logo. And this is a fact. I'm the first person in the world, in the world, Craig, in mm -hmm. the world, <laughs> to, to customize acoustics. I can't copyright it because it's phone. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But to customize it the way I did, yeah. never been done. Price point super high. But guess what? If you want it, you're going to get it. Okay. Just like when people want those Jordans, they go and get uh, it. Yeah. Just like when they want that Ferragama, they go and get it. Yeah. They go and get everything they want. You can have anything you want in this life. And don't let nobody tell you. Just got to put that mind to it. A lot of people told me I couldn't do certain things, but I had to educate myself and figure it out and then to, to apply it and then do it. And once I did it and it was done, it's just another notch on my belt. Just another notch on my belt. Mm -hmm. Just another notch on my belt. So when things finally subside and, and, and I choose to settle with my kids and, and my family and just not be this, which I doubt I could never be this because I'm always be this, um, I could I could lay back and say, I did this, I did this, and I could kick some jewels, you know what I'm saying? And I listen to people. I don't care, old or young. If you younger than me and yeah, you, you kick might got a jewel. No bullshit, though. This is a jewel that, like, I noticed that work for me personally. I don't know. I like to work when people sleeping. Facts. Uh, yeah. When people sleeping, or oh, it's a Saturday night, right? And I really want to just get some things done. I want to create a business plan. I want to do some things, planning, boom, boom, boom. And everybody hitting the clubs, party. Uh, I'm working. Facts. Uh, I'm facts. working. You, being, you feel like you're getting hit and like. 1 a.m., you, know, you sleep? Uh, I'm working. Uh, you know what I'm saying? All night facts. writing. This that, shit. That, yeah, like, and that's like for real. Like, I woke up at what, 7 o'clock this morning, wrote a 12 page paper. You know what I'm saying? Then, boom, I'm about to start my memoirs. Like, I'm working. Like, and that's that's one thing I noticed. Like, just pick certain times if you find a lot of hard motivating. Set your alarm for you. Facts. Wake up when when there's no when there's no light outside yeah. and start working. You got to do that. There's you got to always work. Bro. There's a movie called Money Never Sleep and and that's and that's another slogan that's stuck in my head. Money never sleep. Time right. is money. Love somebody somewhere spending some Us money. Us all money never We're, sleep. We in a multi-billion that, dollar man. business. You heard? Especially like, right now. Yeah, multi-billion <laughs> dollars. You could take something this and turn it into nothing. I I I I applaud those mothers that do something at home and they got a job and they do they side thing is making plates of food. You know what I'm saying? Real or they side, Yeah, word. I, I applaud the I applaud the mothers. I'm gonna start with the mothers first that's doing counterproductive things on their downtime. They little two minutes they got. I don't care what it is, if they if they make a jacket or make a, a scrunchie they make something. Long as you making something and being innovative, yeah. that's what we born to do. Uh, it's oh, to yeah. try to try. All I did was take that idea and maximize it. That's all I did. So, and and now, I applaud the fathers who who got the strikes on them for taking risk, taking chance, putting their life on the line. And then getting out of jail and turning it around and doing what they got to do. Definitely. You know what I'm saying? I applaud them because they could have packed it up and said, y'all, I'm done. Man. They could. Don't pack it up. Never give up, man. Never, Never. give a motherfucking up, man. I seen a meme. A frog was in a, 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 a seagull mouth and he was choking that seagull. And it said, never give up. He was he about to get ate and he choking that seagull. That's a fact. No, nah, no, for real. That's a fact. Mm -hmm. Like, y'all just picked me up from my spot, right? Like, I got that in 2015. 2014, I was homeless, G. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you were telling us mm -hmm. that. Facts. That and then 2015, I'm in a condo. 
that that yeah. that you feel me? that go yeah. all that back goes. There, you never you never give up. Yeah, you never give know what tomorrow, up. Home, man. You always yeah. be a glass half full type of thinker, man. Right. That's basically episode twenty seven, man. We got Lou Heffernan in the building. In the building. Yeah. Queasy's yeah. way, size twenty four. I'm behind this high society. Episode 27, we out, man. Ain't got no job, Tommy. Like, subscribe, comment below. Hit city. We out.